Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Studios. Today in the studio, I'm going to show you how to change your PlayStation 4 background to any image. So let's go ahead and jump in the video right now. So you can go ahead and change your PlayStation 4 background to any image. And this is very easy to get a custom image. So I'm on the home screen of the PlayStation 4. What I'm going to do is go to the middle bar here and scroll all the way to the right. R press the R1 button and I'll bring you over to the start slash library menu. Let's go ahead and press X on this. Now we're going to want to go down to applications and go over to your internet browser. Select this and start this up. Now once this loads up, go to the search bar by pressing triangle and then type in Bing, B-I-N-G and press R2 done. And I'll bring you over to the Google uh, search category here and then go to bing.com. Bing is a little bit better for the images which we're gonna go ahead and view on our PlayStation 4. So let's type in Call of Duty right now. Press R2 done. Now on the top, let's go over to images. Now you can literally do this for any image, just go ahead and type it in. Now let's scroll down. So we got some Call of Duty images on here. So we got Call of Duty Mobile right here. Uh, this one looks like Black Ops. So let's go ahead and choose one of these images. So this one's kind of cool. Let's choose this one. So when I go ahead and press X on this, it's going to bring me to this screen. Now this is why you want Bing over Google because it'll open up the window for you. And now I can go ahead and cl click on the image and it's going to open up the image in an entire window here. Then I can press square and go full screen. Now I'm going to go ahead and move this cursor all the way to the right and get it off the screen. Now I'm going to go ahead and double press the share button and I'm going to take an image, a screenshot of this picture. So this picture now has been saved on my PlayStation 4. So what I can do now is I can press the PlayStation button, go back to the home screen and then go all the way over to the right to library again, go back to applications and then go to capture gallery and start up your capture gallery. Now go to all and then go to the right and press options and then go to sort by and make sure you're viewing it by the date. So your most recent image is at the top. So here is my image right here that I just went ahead and took. I'm going to press options on this image and then I'm going to go over to set as background and I'm going to go ahead and crop this the way I want and press X and this image now will be my background on my PlayStation 4. So I can make the function area dim. And I can set the colors for the menu right here. So now I'm going to go to apply and it's applying that image. Now let's go back to my home screen. So now that custom image is my background on my PlayStation 4. And this is very easy to do guys. Go ahead, go to your internet browser, save the screenshot and use it as a theme on your PlayStation 4. So if this video did indeed help you out, go ahead and leave a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more PlayStation 4 tech help videos coming up next on Your 6 Studios.